Now let's talk about next pattern. There will be two exam, next one and next two. First I will talk about next one. Next one, it will be competitive and licentiating exam. It will be all India on an exam. There will be 540 MCQs. The subject wise distribution of marks as follows. This is three days exam with six papers. On the day one, prelims paper will be of medicine plus elite subjects. Elite subject means all minor clinical subjects like orthopedics, radiology, anesthesia, psychiatry, and dermatology. On second day, prelims paper will be of surgery plus elite subject and post lunch paper will be of ENT. And on the day three, prelims paper will be of obstgyno plus elite subjects and post lunch paper will be of ophthalmology. 120 question will be asked in prelims papers and 60 question will be asked in post lunch papers. Time duration for prelims papers will be 3 hour and for post lunch paper will be 1 and a half hour. 10% question will be asked from applied basic science, means preclinical subjects of first to third year. It may be overlapped with clinical subjects and may be directly from them. And 10% question will be asked from PSM. So all subjects are important for next exam. But exam will be clinical oriented. Types of questions 60% will be problem solving. Problem solving means they will give you clinical scenario or clinical case. This type of question will be lengthy. This is problem solving question. Clinical scenario based. 30% will be comprehension and analysis based. So this type of question will be IBQs, image based questions. And they will give you data in questions, then you will solve it. It may be graphical questions. This is comprehension and analysis based question. And 10% recall questions. This type of questions based on facts. It may be one liner and directly from books. Next two pattern. It is only pass or fail exam. You won't get any score in this exam. It will be held by university where you will doing your internship. It will be totally practical examination. They will check your practical and clinical knowledge. It is mandatory to pass this exam for permanent license and for PG seat. But your PG seat and branch will be decided by your next one score.